Hey what's up guys in this video we're going to talk about array in C++ programming. The array is used to store a number of data elements in contiguous memory locations. And all the data elements share a common name which is the name of the array. And to declare one array first you have the data type of the array then the name of the array and then inside the square bracket we specify the size of that array. Like an example first you have the data type of the array then the name like my array and then inside the square bracket we specify the size of the array so in this line of statement we are creating one array called my array which can store integer type of data elements and it can store five data elements now we're going to see how we can initialize one array we can declare and initialize an array at the same time like an example here we have one integer array x and we are declaring and initializing the array with bunch of numbers and we can specify the size of the array while initializing it and also if we do not specify the size then the compiler will automatically calculate the size of that array so to declare and initialize one array first we have the data type of the array then the name of the array and then inside the square bracket we have the size and after the equal sign inside the curly braces we pass in the data elements we wanted to store in that array and at the end we have to close that statement with one semicolon so in this example we are declaring and creating one array where we have specified the size of that array and also we can declare and initialize one array without specifying the size in that case the compiler will automatically calculate the size of that array and we don't have to specify the size and now we're going to see how we can access the array elements the array index is used to access the array elements and the array indexing starts from zero the syntax is first we have the array name and then inside the square bracket we specify the index of that element we wanted to access like an example here we have one array called my array now we can access the elements of that array and the array indexing starts from zero so the first element is at index zero the second element at index one and third element at index two and so on and so forth so to access the first element of that array we have to write the name of the array and then inside the square bracket we have to pass in the index of that element and this will return the first element of that array and similarly we can pass in the index 1 and this will return the second element of that particular array and also we can assign a new value to the array element in that case we have to first select the index position and then we can assign a new value to this element and with that statement the second position of that array will be updated with the new value which is 10 and similarly we can assign a new value to the first element and suppose we can assign the value 5 and by doing so the first element of that array will be updated with the new value which is 5 so this is the way we can declare one array and we can declare and initialize with specifying the size or we can declare and initialize without specifying the size of the array and also we can access array elements with one index and also we can assign a new value to the array so hope you understand about the concept of array in c++ programming we'll see you in the next one thank you